What's up guys, this is KJ48, welcome back to my Osiris New Dawn Let's Play. This is episode 6, and the reason I said that so slowly was because my New Dawn notepad says episode 5. I never typed episode 6 on there. Well, let's hope, hopefully I remember that at the outro. <laughs> uh, I'm recording this right after episode 5, so if you guys gave me some good ideas on what to call you guys in the beginning of the video, um, I'm sorry, but I didn't see it. Um, but I'm going to show you something really freaking cool in a minute. First of all... I'm going to kill some aliens because it's freaking fun in this thing. I love it. Uh, and you know what? The nighttime, like, guys won't even be that big of a deal because I'll just hop on this thing and just slaughter stuff. Like, look at this guy over here, man. You know who this, guy's rem you know who this guy reminds me of? By the way, this game really reminds me of Starship Troopers. This reminds me of those big tunneler bugs. Remember in Starship Troopers? The one that they threw the grenade in its mouth? And, it like, I think they shoot flame as well. That's what this thing reminds me of. Man, look at that thing. It's like a big dung beetle or something. I'm going to freaking kill it because I don't like the way it looks. I'm going to shoot it right in its ugly dung beetle face. Yeah. Taste my justice, dung beetle. I don't need your meat. Every time I log out and log back in, my hydration and, and nutrition goes all the way up. So I'm not really that worried about it. All right. I want to show you one other cool thing. And this is going to be cool. And you could, you could do this in two separate ways. I'm going to show you one right now. Check this out. See that? Boom. Huh? You want to see something else that's cool? Someone told me about this and I completely forgot about it. Uh, let's shoot this. Oh, that's actually a lot slower. Someone told me I could shoot these things with my gun. But that's a lot slower, so I wouldn't shoot it with that gun. But you could shoot it with your uh, hover bike gun. That, thing, that thing's freaking awesome. So let me pick up this iron so we don't waste it. And uh, let's get to building. I think we've got a barracks to build, don't we, people? I think we've got a barracks to build. Man, I am overweight as hell. Where's my where's my hover vessel? Hover vessel. God, I think I'm playing Imperion. Where's my hover bike? Damn it. I want to get a hover bike in Imperion. I should look for one on the on the, the workshop. <laughs> All right. Where the vehicle? Okay. Let's get back. Drop this crap off. Well, actually, we could just go make the barracks right now. Might as well. Alright, so let's come on over here. This is where the barracks is going to be. Get out of this thing. Put some stuff in there. Alright. Barracks, people. Here we go. Barracks hype! There we go. Barracks. What up? How you like me now? Now, I'm still worried about this habitat being bugged. So, although the overview on the habitat does say it's all the way up. So it might be okay. We should do something with him, shouldn't we? Yeah, follow me. We're going to put you on iron. We're going to put you on iron detail. Come on over here, buddy. Actually, I probably don't need to go all the way over there. If I just go right here, press H. I could just put this over there and he'll probably get iron. We'll just keep a lookout for what he's getting, and if he's getting if he's getting aluminum, we'll go over there and fix him. All right, let's see what we're going to need to do to build this barracks. All right, so... Going to need some walls on this bad boy. And they are... Oh, okay. Uh, aluminum and steel only, huh? That's interesting. You can only put one kind of uh, thing in there. And Okay, so aluminum and steel. Well, let's get going. We just happen to have a lot of aluminum and steel, people. So I don't know what good the barracks is. I know you can only build certain things in here. So I guess that's what it's for. They just want to give you a different room to build different things. But I don't know. I don't really know why you need a different room just to build stuff in here. Well, you know what you could build in here is the the bed. So, But like you couldn't build a bed in a... You couldn't build a bed in a habitat like if you really needed to sleep. But, eh, you know. They do it for gameplay purposes. They want the game to be interesting. So that's cool. And I welcome different rooms. That's for sure. I'd like a storage room. I'd like a... He's getting iron. Okay, good. I'd like a storage room. I would like all kinds of rooms. Storage room. Um, maybe a laboratory. And I, I would... You know the things that builds our ships and stuff? I wouldn't call that a laboratory. That should be like a hangar or something like that. Um, definitely not a laboratory. Um, keep, keep feeling like I'm saying laboratory. We could use a laboratory. I got to do my dirty sinful business. Simpson joke. 
but yeah, uh, I would call that something different, and I would and I would call I would make a laboratory where you would make the uh, chemistry station and the the you know the fabricator and all that kinds of stuff. All right, so we just need a little bit more aluminum, and we are done with this bad boy. We are really making some progress now, people. All right, we need some more aluminum. We should have a lot of aluminum, or as the uh, my friends across the pond like to say, aluminium. Aluminium actually goes with the periodic table, like the way the minium, aluminium sound or whatever. I remember hearing a podcast about that. It's pretty interesting. Um, do I not have a lot of aluminum? Hmm. I should probably put them on aluminum, maybe. Okay, here we go. Should make a bed in here. I wonder if we have, I wonder if we have everything we need. There we go. Barracks, people. All right, so what can I make in the barracks? Let's take a look at furniture. The bed. That can only go in the barracks. Uh, just grab some iron and some rubber. Let's do it. There we go. Activate. Pressurized. Very good. Actually, I don't think I'm going to make this place with all my lockers. I'm going to make this like an entry. Like, this is going to be a habitat that goes out into all the different like buildings so i won't i won't do too much in here um for that reason all right furniture bed time for sleepy time uh right there or right there i kind of like it on the side yeah right there's fine it's weird they don't let you make any windows in the barracks right like i don't want to wake up without windows all right check me out okay what else can i make in here uh, we made the bed. We should just make everything, right? I mean, there's no reason not to. We should just go right down the list and make everything. Ooh, a shower. We can kind of make that right now. I'm feeling kind of dirty. Three wires and five glass. All right, let's do, let's do that. Three wires and five glass. What does wires take? I forget. Wires take gold and more rubber. I don't know how much gold I have. Yeah, I actually got a lot of gold, but I think some of it's outside. Let's put this stuff away. Oh, we don't have any more. We should make another. You know what? We should make another storage locker in here. You know what we need to do before we make another storage locker? We have to decide which way we're going to expand the base. So let's come on over here and see what we can see. Honestly, I think we should just expand it right here. Yeah, expand it again right here, and then we'll make this, we'll make, we'll expand it right here, make another habitat. I don't think I can make any other different structures, right? Oh, a biodome. Forgot about that. All right, that's going to be another, another episode. But anyway, um, oh, where do I want to put the biodome? Honestly, it really doesn't matter. I should probably take that, take that inflatable dome down, shouldn't I? It's just in the way. Yeah, I probably will. Anyway, um. Uh, we can come over here, and we can come out here probably, like, two spots. So one can be the biodome, and the other one, this will be the, uh, th this one right here. I'll have, I'll have a hallway coming out here and a, and a habitat right here. And this will be the, my storage room. And then I'll have another one connected to there that comes out here. That will be my crafting room. And then where that window is, I'll have another one coming out here, and that'll be the biodome. Got it. Got it. And we got some glass. Is that everything we needed for the shower? Uh, yeah, we just need aluminum in the, um, I, you know, now that I said aluminum, I'm, like, having a hard time, like, I'm, I want to say aluminum. Uh, the aluminum, there we go. And this has to be done in the barracks. Right? Shower, yes, okay. Shower, oh. Oh. Perfect. I love this game. It's so good. Please tell me I can take a shower. I can't take a shower? Oh, well, I guess future. A future update. I will be able to take a shower. Well, at least I have a shower. Hey, this thing looks open. What is this? This isn't pressurized. Ah, I really can't believe I can't take a shower. I thought I'd be able to. Can I take my helmet off or something? I mean, I'm in a pressurized thing. Eh, whatever. All right, what can we make next? What can we make next? In barracks. Okay, yeah, let's make a couch. 
Oh, I'm so awesome. I'm so excited making all these cool things. Uh, glass. I don't think we need glass for the couch, but what else do we need for the couch? I don't remember. Oh, yeah. Those stupid plastics. I hate those things because I always got to get hydrogen for them. <laughs> I don't like getting hydrogen. Okay, couch. Yep. Yep. Looks good. Can I sit on that? Ah. Oh. oh, cool. Oh my god, what is that? That's an Atari 2600. It's a freaking Atari 2600. Are you are you kidding me? Let's play some let's play some warlords or some I was going to say E.T., but I don't think we want to play E.T., right? What do we want to play? Moon Patrol? Warlords? Um, Custer's Revenge? I mean, come on, man. That's a freaking Atari. Uh, developers, you are freaking something else, man. You guys are... You guys are awesome. No joke, dude. No joke. All right, let's see what we can make next in there. I just want to, I just want to keep making stuff in that barracks. That's for the habitat. That's for the kitchen in the barracks. Let's make a kitchen. We just need some wire. There we go. I can't believe there's an Atari 2600 in my barracks on the on Mars. Well, this isn't really Mars, but still. Build inside a barracks. You need a habitat to build a kitchen. Okay, that's a... They must have mis, uh, mislabeled that. Okay, well, you know what? You wouldn't have a kitchen in your, in your bedroom. I mean, you know, you'd have a shower, you know, an Atari 2600... On, like, this must be the year 3500 or something. This must be super in the future. And this guy has a friggin' Atari 2600. I can't get over that. All right, let's see. We can, we can make steamed carrots. We can grill up some meat. We haven't been looting anything. Because, like I said, every time we restart our hydrogen and... Or, sorry, our, our hydration and our nutrition keep resetting. So, not really needed. But we'll, we'll cook up some stuff at some point. Okay, um, that is the habitat that we've already made. That is the habitat. That's the habitat. That's the barracks. That's the ha I think we've made everything we can in the barracks. Habitat. Oh, computer desk goes in the barracks. Oh, let's make one right now. Very good. So I wonder I wonder what kind of video games I'm going to be playing on this thing. What do you got? What do you got for me? It's a nice looking laptop. That looks like a space laptop, though. That doesn't look like anything that's going to play video games. Can I sit in the chair? Doesn't seem like I can. Maybe I could do this. Here we go. Here we go. Let's play. Let's let's uh let's fire up some Seven Days to Die, huh? Okay. All right. Enough games. We got work to do. All right. So that is the computer desk and computer desk serves an information depot. Unlock crafting recipes. I thought you were supposed to be able to interact with the computer desk. Can you not? Am I just missing it? Also, does anybody know what that blue line underneath means? I'm thinking that might be power, but I don't think power is working just yet. Yeah, can can I interact with the computer desk, guys? I don't I don't see any way to. Let me know in the comments if there's a way I can interact with the computer desk. Uh, climate controls for the habitat. That's for the Probably the habitat, the bed I already made. All right, barracks is done, people. I've done everything I can in the barracks. Okay, well, let's see what else we can make in the habitat. Maybe we should start working on the. Yeah, you know what? This is gonna. This uh, locker is gonna have to come out. That locker is gonna have to come out. Okay, so let's go ahead and set up another storage item thingy. What is that called? Storage locker. Yeah. All right, so we're gonna put this one right here. That one will definitely be there for a while. We're going to move everything from that storage locker to this one. Then we're going to start working on the habitat part that's going to be going. Maybe we should do the biodome first. No, I want... Well, I really should do the biodome first because I know people are going to want to see it. But I kind of want my stuff to be organized before then. And that's not really going to happen. Well, I guess it could happen in here. I probably should make the biodome next, next episode. Come on. Come on, you slow ass. All right, you all get in there. Maybe I'll do some organizing off camera. We'll see. 
All right, so we gotta we gotta get rid of this thing. No matter what, this is this is gonna be a. We don't want we don't want to ex extend the base this way because it's going into some some shrubbery. So let's extend it this way. All right, guys. I made a second storage locker, and I think I'm gonna make a third. I think with three storage lockers in here, I could somewhat organize. Not as much as I'd like to, but I could somewhat organize. Let me show you. This is my. This right here is my my chest with non ores i guess that's where the barrels go that's where my sand goes the shovel like basically like a tools chest kind of and this one's gonna be for ores and i've got them and also pieces i'm gonna put these pieces in another chest though uh but i think i got the ores you know kind of kind of sort of organized i'm gonna need more i'm gonna need more chests to organize this properly the way i want to organize it but for now this is working this will work pretty good until i get the until I get the storage room up. The thing is, I want to make the habitat for you guys next episode. Can't do that if I got to make the storage area next episode. So we're going to push the storage episode back. And, uh, you know, that way I can do this right now. All right. That's enough storage for on video. Let's uh, let's break this thing down. We did we did empty it, right? I'm pretty sure. So, uh, let's make sure. I, I don't want to lose anything for no reason. You know what? Before we take that down, let's set up our droid to get let's set up our, our droid to get uh, stop doing iron and start getting um, aluminum. You come with me. Follow me, boy. Get over here. It's a little tricky to get him to get a, to make him get aluminum. A lot of times when I try and tell him to get aluminum, he just starts getting iron, which is annoying. Uh, so I kind of find if I do it like right here, He'll get aluminum? Will he get aluminum? Looks like he's going for aluminum. Yeah, he's getting aluminum. Cool. Is this thing almost full? Nah, this thing. Well, actually, it's getting pretty close. I'm gonna bring my I'm gonna bring my hover bike over here and, and empty that out, but I'll do that off camera. Okay, let's come back over here. And let's take a look at this. This thing's looking badass. No joke, bro. No joke. This this I, I like the building of this game. It's really freaking good. I just wish oxygen was a problem. I know oxygen is not a problem yet. When oxygen is a problem, this game's gonna be ten times better. Because right now it's just kinda like whatever, dude. Like you don't have oxygen, it doesn't even matter. Yes. Yes. Okay, so we'll come over here. We're gonna wanna do another hallway, and we're gonna need all that stuff. Iron, aluminum, steel, and plastic. Iron, aluminum, steel, and plastic. Iron, aluminum, steel, and plastic. Oh yeah, the kitchen. I was like, what is that thing? <laughs> Iron, aluminum, steel, and plastic. Well, there's some steel and plastic. Iron and aluminum. Oh, we don't have a lot of aluminum. Hmm. Well, that's a problem. Let's go get some aluminum. You got some aluminum for me yet? You better, damn you. Oh, you know what? I might have some in my bike. I actually was putting was storing stuff in my bike earlier. I've actually got aluminum right here, too. I could just get that. There it is. Okay, what you got for me? What you got for me? Nope, just iron. Yeah, that's fine. Mining aluminum like a boss. I wonder, if I, I wonder if you could pick this up just by driving over it. No. Can you pick it up just by being close to it? No. No. Darn it. It'd be cool if you could somehow pick this stuff up without getting off your bike. They should give us some they should give us like some kind of hover vehicle with like a scoop mechanic or something that can like grab stuff for us. Am I getting lazy or No, I just want stuff to be quicker. I mean, that's that's the whole point of this stuff. I think we're going to need some more steel, but I'm not sure, so let's go inside and check it out. I'm not going to go in through the front door because it'll do that pressurization thing, which is annoying. So you go in through the back so you don't have to deal with that. Okay. All right. So structures. Yeah, we're gonna need some more steel. One thing I am gonna do is I'm going to leave most of my iron, aluminum, and magnesium out here because they should let you have a forge in your habitat too. I think because you know that would be nice. No, oh God, nothing's in here. Oh crap. Oh crap. All right. Well, where's where's my Am I out of, uh, am I out of magnesium? That would be a shame. 
I mean, I could just go back to my chest and get it, but... See, I gotta pressurize this, even though it's obviously not pressurized in here. Uh, do I have any magnesium? It would be in here if I did. Uh, yeah, a little bit. That's not a lot. It'll be enough for today, though. And what I'll do is I'll just take my bike back to the magnesium pit, because remember I set up a... Actually, I don't know if I showed you. I set up a chest just like he's doing out there. I set up a chest with the magnesium pit as well. So he's getting magnesium in that way. Uh, I don't know if I showed it to you. I think I did, but just in case I didn't, it's always good to explain. All right, take that. And I think that's it. Should be enough. Yep, we're still light on aluminum, but that's okay. It'll be enough. So throw all that stuff back in there. I, I wish when you shift click it, when you shift clicked back into an inventory, they stacked because they don't. Although I think I just, iron just stacked. Hold on. No, see, it doesn't. So, and this didn't stack either. Yeah, that shift click mechanic needs to automatically stack. Alright. I don't know why I just went through there, but because I wasn't thinking. There we go. Nope, I still can't make it. Oh, the iron and aluminum. Crap. Darn it. Darn it, cage. Iron and aluminum. Go get it. Whoops. This guy's been hard at work. It's good that we're gonna we're gonna have to empty this anyway, because it doesn't have a lot of stuff. And you want to be as close as possible. And then what you do is you come over here and you just start emptying it and putting it into your bike. Take four iron and four stacks of al aluminum, aluminium, whatever you want to call it. Put it in your bike. And let's just grab some more since we're here. Alright, that's all the that's all the aluminum we have, but that's okay, that's a that's a good amount of aluminum. Alright. Turn on the light. Oh god. I love the light. Alright, let's just leave this thing right here. Oh, when you get off there's no more light. By the way, are we gonna be attacked? I'm probably not going to stick around for the attack. I think we're coming up to the end of this video. I think I'm going to maybe try and not restart the game from now on. So, whoa, what happened? Oh. I think I'm going to try and try not to restart the game anymore. Because I want, I want there to be the attacks. But we're getting close to the end of the video. And I'm not going to be able to stay for the whole thing. i got to go pick up my wife at the, uh, at the airport. So, All right, hallway. We just need iron. So you have some iron for me. All right, and let's put down the hallway. And I think next video is going to be the habitat. So, oh, that's right. I need to put a coupler on there. You guys are probably telling me that in the comments too. Oh, coupler. All right, you know what? We're going to do this. We're going to do this next next episode. Um, no, we're not. We're going to do it right now. God darn it. I want to make something. All right, so we just need plastic, uh, rubber and titanium. Rubber and titanium. Rubber and titanium. That should be the rubber should be in here. So much easier when you're organized. Although the no, the rubber's not in there. Well, if I was, I don't know. I don't even know what to say to that. I just I, <laughs> I don't know why. It's good to be organized, and I'm freaking wrong. I'm looking in the wrong spot. Can't make this stuff up. Couple of. All right, guys. Next episode, you will see a habitat, I promise. And that's going to be it for episode six. And we'll see you next time for episode seven. Till then, take it easy.